So now let's see how we can work around with light and color correction inside of Adobe Photoshop Express. So over here I have an image and this has a certain lighting condition. If you want to go around and adjust it, then over here on the left hand side, you can go around on the correction section right here. And there's the light and color correction section as you can see right here. So you can work around with the exposure. So if I were to go around and click, you get the slider right here and you can go around and change around the brightness as you can see right here, just like this. Apart from that, you can work around with the contrast right here and change the difference between black and white. You can work around with the highlights that is the bright parts of the image. So let's say, let's just go around and decrease this out right here. Then you can work around with the shadows that is the dark parts. So let's just go around and increase it out right here, just like this. So there's a lot of exposure right here right now. So I'm just going to go around and decrease this out around over here, right here. So this is the before and after, as you can see, this is the before right here, and this is the after the correction. You can see that I can get more details out of it right here. You can also work around with the whites right here, make the whites more brighter as you can see right here and get more details out of the black as well, just like this as well. So this is how you can do the light color correction as you can see right here. So apart from that, you can go around with the, uh, well, with the color right here as you can see right here. So with the color, you can go around and go for different um, options like you can go around with the temperature and you can change around the temperature to make it warmer right here or to make it more cooler right here just like this or choose a much more, a much more balanced output right here just like this. Then you can go for tint which uh, you can use to add in more pinkish or more green, more greenish effect as you can see right here. Let's just go around onto a more pink area. Then you can work around with vibrance right here and saturation. So if I were to go for saturation, I can pop up the color right here and decrease out the color as you can see right here. So it affects all of the colors equally right here. But if I were to go around onto vibrance right here, that it then it only affects the weak color and leaves the strong colors as it is. So I can really increase out the vibrance and you can see that the sky and whatever else right here, the background, pops out more while this uh, uh, this particular car um, does not change much. So now I can go to saturation and decrease this out right here to get a more balanced effect as you can see right here just like this. So this is what you have as you can see right here. So now if I were to go around over here you can see that I have done the light and color correction right here. And if I were to go around see the before and after, this is the change that you see as you can see right here just like this. And that is how you can do light and color correction inside of Adobe Photoshop Express. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.